Welcome, I'm Bev Adams. I'm an independent demonstrator with Stampin' Up! And one of the things that I love to do is organize my products in Evernote. Evernote becomes a searchable catalog so I can look for all kinds of things. I can find a stamp, a particular stamp set that I'm looking for. I can find things that coordinate. Um, I can find, one of the things that I've found is I can find if I have a leftover stamp that somehow got s separated from its case, I can find where it goes to by looking for the elements that are on that stamp. Same is true of framelits. And so if you want to share these notes with me, I'd be happy to share. Just shoot me an email to bevadams at verizon.net. You can go to my website, bevadams.com, and get more information under Techie Tips. And if you look up at the note, let me open a particular, let me open a stamp set. For instance, this note is for Southern Serenade. It's got the name, catalog, and page where you'll find the stamp. It shows that there's a set of eight stamps, and they're rubber stamps. If you decide to get it in a clear mount, it shows the blocks that you will need. It's got the image of the stamp set. It's got the number. This, this stamp set does not come in French or German. So it's got the prices for U.S. in wood mount or clear mount, in Canada, in euros and pounds if you're in the European market. And if you're in the South Pacific, whether you're working with Australian dollars or New Zealand dollars. Down here at the bottom, I have, what I do is I go through and type in every phrase that's in the stamp set. And then I also try to describe all the images that I see. At the top, it has tags. So I think that this stamp set would be great for a birthday. It is a clear mount. It does have some greetings. It's got line drawing, like this stamp set would be great for coloring, whether you're using the watercolor pencils, the new Stampin' Blends, or any of your coloring um, strategies. It's in the Occasions 18 catalog. It's a stamp. It's also uh, for thanks, and it also comes in wood mount. These are all up here tags, and they are listed down the left side. Now, if you are sharing my current products, you will not have all of these catalogs listed, but you'll have quite a few. Some stamp sets, like Lovely as a Tree, has been around, so it will have tags for all the years it's been in a catalog. When you get Evernote, if you're sharing my notebook, all these tags will show up uncategorized. All of the tags will be listed on your list without any of these triangles. All these triangles I can click and show you that I have dragged the dies tag into the big shot. I've also dragged big dies to dies, edgelets, embosslets, framelets, and thinlets. Those each have their own separate tag, but they are all under the category of dies, and those are all in the category of big shots, and also embossing folders are in big shots. So I can kind of hide those tags to make this list a lot shorter. It's really easy to, to drag this catalog back to catalogs. I just hold down my mouse key, drag it so that the word catalogs is highlighted and let it go and it shows up under catalogs. Maybe you don't like to see a lot of tags at all, so you can put them under tags by Bev, close that up and you won't see any tags at all or hardly any. But if it's helpful for you to see all these other tags, um, like I usually keep the catalogs tag closed. I have another category of events, so if I'm looking to do an anniversary card, these are all the stamp sets that I think might be good for anniversary. I have all these holidays. I have another category 
of paper, 6x6, 12x12, cardstock, and designer series paper, shortcut DSP. I have under stamps, I have clear mount, gratings, personalized, photopolymer, and wood mount. Again, if you're not sharing my retired products catalog, um, you will not see the personalized because we don't have any current personalized tags. Um, I have themes which I should probably put under in with the events. I have encouragement, kids, love, music, nature, nautical, outdoor, prayer, travel, weather. Those are subcategories of themes that have tags. On my Windows machine, I can even right click. Um, in this case, I'm going to right click over Tags by Bev. And I'm going to create a tag in Tags by Bev and just call it Content. And then that, that tag shows up here. I don't have any tags with content, but that will be a category. And I have decided to drag my events into content and also drag my themes into content. And this can be slow. Sorry it's taking so long. So I'm just dragging that into content. And so when I open up content, it has my it has my things. Oh, and I dragged the wrong thing into content. Hmm. So easy to do. I'm going to drag this tag into catalogs. And now that I've clicked on mine, I'm going to all notebooks. Sorry that it's not what you want to see. But I do want to have in content, I have events and themes. And so I have all my events and my themes all under content. Perfect. I have translations. There are a few stamp sets that come in Dutch. Quite a few that are French and German and a few that have a separate UK variation. I am very uh, geared into North America and so I do think of translations as being something other than English. Um, but I do make an effort to include all the markets. So um, I just wanted to show you how easy it is to move the categories around to, to drag them in there. I also want to warn you that sometimes it's uh, easy to accidentally drag, um, like maybe I might accidentally drag bow into Big Shot, and now it's hard for me to find if I've closed Big Shot, bow will not be listed. So if you can't find a tag, you might want to look in those categories. So if you want to share my Evernote notebook, I'd be happy to share. Just let me know what you're asking for. I also have a Techie Tip video on how you can create your own notebook and copy my notes into it so, you, so your notebook has the products you own. It's really lovely to be able to look through your products without opening a cupboard or anything. You just open your computer and scroll through what you have and find out exactly what you want. So um, yay for the new catalog occasions 2018 and also celebration. Yay! I will have all these notes for the new products in my current products notebook. If you are already sharing my notebook, 
as soon as you start synchronizing, these notes should show up in that shared notebook of current products. It will give you more time for stamping, and that's what we all love. Thank you for stopping by. Talk to you soon.